going on everybody Z here and welcome to lens island yes i saw this game and i thought this looked pretty neat so we are gonna be checking it out now it is a it looks like a farming survival base building dungeon crawling like it looks like a whole bunch of different things so i'm super excited to check it out hopefully you guys enjoy if you do like subscribe all the fun things uh world name um we're just gonna go with the the classic of zootopia that sounds great create new game fantastic and we're gonna hop on in okay um how do you control len wasd oh my developer recommended mouse no i like wasd personally i'm not a fan of the point and click kind of stuff uh so let's try that and where is len from uh zengard of course what is len's facial type uh masculine next does len wear shoes no definitely not <laughs> Uh, can we change like oh is this our shirt um okay oh should we have pants oh we should have pants we should look super classy <gasps> oh and of wait is that a backpack i think a vest is i think a vest is needed as well all right let's do it let's start the game okay so oh yes oh so we've got an axe a knife what do we have in here manage your hotbar and backpack uh drag unlocked items into your hotbar and equip them or drag an item off your hotbar to unequip it any unequipped hotbar items are automatically sent to your chest for storage all of your resources are accessible from your backpack at any time and do not require storage okay so that's nice uh equip food items by dragging them directly from your backpack to your hotbar okay so weapons is this better than what we have i feel like it's what we already have uh, i think oh it is what we already have because it's on our hotbar okay so what do we even do right now oh crafting stuff every home starts with a good foundation am i supposed to go somewhere i i thought like i started off with like something but maybe not do we have a map doesn't look like we have a map um let's just kind of explore around here a little bit let's get our knife out uh oh here's a little cabin Looks like we could probably is this gonna be our like our is this our cabin maybe that's what it wants us to start with let's kind of explore around here hold on let's follow these pathways oh trees and stuff everywhere it looks super cool so we've got health and we've got hunger can i go through the water oh absolutely uh can we oh shift is to roll or dodge maybe okay let's see i'm just trying to do a little bit of exploration here kind of figure out what's going oh there's a dungeon maybe we don't start with a dungeon right away <laughs> maybe we use the house that we just found and fix it up um we got another look nice little beach area right over here all right well you know what let's just start with the house right here i think all right well let's just start with this house let's get it cleaned up um okay so axe is this gonna clear the debris out of the way maybe okay so we got those now can we go into build and uh wooden wall i feel like our house needs to be bigger than that no wooden foundation well you know what let's just stick with the wall for now oh look at we have a house we're safe we've beat the game oh my gosh we've done it <laughs> oh, i'm just kidding um okay wood frame farm and a stone well i feel like that might be some good stuff to get going soon what do we have here bed skip the night sleep all right so we need some like reeds we need some logs and stuff like that okay so let's grab maybe the knife we'll grab reeds uh yeah okay we got to read from that that looks interesting um but these guys wow that bush oh i tell you what oh we got four reads from that one though so it looks like maybe the ones that are like fully grown are the way to go awesome let's get some logs too time each attack to trigger a critical hit for more damage you can deal more damage timing your hits instead of holding down to auto hit time your next swing when this when you see the circle 
the crit circle expanding click down during the crit window to trigger a critical attack deal bonus damage okay i don't see a circle though oh oh i like it oh neato oh we probably should equip the right weapon here oh that is actually kind of cool okay um i feel like a bed is going to be like super useful Oh, wow. We just gave it like the one, two. Holy moly. We are like masters with the knife here. Okay, so we've got a few logs. We don't have very much food. I mean, we've got... Can we eat these? How do I eat these? I have blueberries right there. Um, I don't know. Oh, what's that? We followed the orders. The bridges have been destroyed and the second cave entrance demolished. We will be heading back early in the morning. Oh, okay. So let's go into building here. Uh, we can build a bed. Uh, you know what? Maybe we should be in the house. So we can kind of see what's going on here. Oh, jeez, Luis, the bed is the full size of the house? All right, let's just get this, like, right here. Perfect. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> that is a huge bed. All right, so what do we need for, like, food stuff? Um, That looks like maybe clay and stone and reeds and then logs and reeds for that i don't know that i have anything blueberries doesn't say that i have any but i have them right here hmm oh is this the bridgewater town what is this 80 stone and 40 limestone oh that's how we get to the town oh okay well, let's focus on ourselves here for a minute Ooh, there's a barrel. Uh, oh, what did we get? Is that some gears or something? I don't know, something useful maybe. Oh, all we do is have to hit four and then we eat. I was like, I gotta figure this out. <laughs> all I do is have to tap four and we eat it. <laughs> Super simple. Okay, so now, um, farm plot. Like, I feel like we should have a farm, but I don't, I don't want to get ahead of myself yet. Um, I mean, obviously we need a bigger house for absolutely everything. A workbench. Ooh, we need 12 gears for that. Let's just get a little farm plot going here. Oh, wow. That thing is huge. Um, let's put it right there. And then we'll knock the street down and we can put another one next to that. I don't know if we can actually grow anything. Oh! Blueberries. Plant all. Oh, darn. I just... Oh, uh, well. Um, <laughs> I don't know if I can water them or not. But hey, that's fine. I think we need to expand our house, too. Um, I'm going to take these trees out right here. So, what did we need for the foundation? Limestone and stone? Okay, well, let's grab a little bit of that. We haven't grabbed any stone yet. Oh, we got 25 stone from that. Nice. And then limestone. Is this limestone or is this clay? Kind of looks like clay, but maybe it's limestone. That definitely looks like clay. So what would limestone look like? Hold on, let's go in here. Uh, resources. Okay, limestone can be found near the water's edge. Used for foundations or crafting decoration. Okay, so we found clay. Was there limestone over here, maybe? Or is that, oh, this is limestone right here, I bet you. Yeah, there's some limestone. And then let's open up this guy. Uh, some more gears, very nice. Okay, so we should be able to build a foundation now. I think our house needs to be significantly bigger. <laughs> Wood foundation. Um, am I out of stuff? No, I'm not. Weird, it won't let me place it there. It won't let me place it there either. 
Is it because of the stuff in the way? I have a feeling it's because of the stuff in the way. Maybe I can put another one on this side? Oh, yeah. Okay, it's getting dark time. It's getting scary. Um, our house is expanding this way. We can't really go out much further this way, so I think I might take this foundation and move it over here. Or maybe behind this house. I don't know. Actually, um, left click, right click. I want to get rid of... Can I move this? I guess let's throw some windows or some walls on here. Kind of wanted to get rid of this thing right here, but I guess we could put a doorway here and then have this extend into our house that way. That might actually be who of us to do. Uh, let's go ahead and sleep for the night. Uh, oh, save and sleep. Ah, oh, it's a beautiful new morning. Okay, I want to figure out this building stuff. Um, what's F? Oh. Recycle. Oh, resources are refunded? Oh, no way! That's super nice. Okay, so now... Ah, see, there we go. That makes sense. Now we need to throw walls up all the way around this thing. Okay. Okay, so let's get some more walls in here. Uh, oh, actually, let's go to... Well, you know what? Let's not edit... Oh, that's right. There's different stories, too. Oh my gosh, we have all kinds of wonderful things here. Um, let's see, let's just get walls. Oh, darn it. Let's see, let's go to F to edit, recycle, and then let's go ahead and get a wall here. And then can we take a wall down, recycle? Oh, there's like an upgrade option. I can't take this wall out right here, though. Oh, here we go. Recycle. Okay. So there's that. Now, we need to throw a roof on all of this. However, if we do a wooden ceiling... What's up? The ceiling. Used for walking on other fun stuff. We could put stairs up later, you know? So let's just close that in for now. And then can we build ourselves a workbench? What do we need for that? 50 logs, easy enough. Oh, look at our little house. Oh, it's not so little anymore. Um, oh, you know what? We need berries. I planted all my berries on accident and I don't think I have anything to water them with either. There we go, berries acquired. Okay, let's get our crafting bench and see what we can do with this guy. Um. Is that right there? Actually, can we move our bed now? Let's let's do that. Let's move our bed. We'll put it right here in the corner. Okay, so what is this? Um so like different windows. Oh, a bay window. Oh, that's super cool. A dormer roof, circular window, a gate. And then oh, iron spear, iron hammer, iron battle axe, iron sword, a shield. Ooh, watering can. What is that? Iron shards. Darn. Iron scythe. Adventurer's torch. Um, iron. Oh, what? Pirate, fisherman, nature, refined, forge. There's all kinds of stuff. Holy moly. And then tool chest. Oh, so all kinds of cool stuff. And then upgrade. Oh, what is this? A refinery it uses steam to grind down large minerals into little bits so you can sift out all the sorts of precious metals and gems. Costs 10 of those. And then a fireplace keeps you warm and cozy while filling the room with the smell of freshly baked bread. And then we've got large bookshelf. What's better than uh, material possessions? Knowledge. <laughs> nice. And then we have garden bed. Cute little bed for your garden. Feeling lost looking for a sign. Okay. So... We need a watering can, but in order to get a watering can, we need um, some iron pieces. But in order to get those iron pieces, I'm thinking we might actually have to get a refinery, maybe? I don't know. We'll have to see here. Let's go ahead and let's um, 
Let's go explore a little bit. We might have to go into the dungeon thing. I kind of feel like we should know our... Oh, what is this? It's a bridge to something. That's cool. Oh, more berries. We need those. Oh, uh, that looks like lavender. Yeah, I think we got lavender out of it. Oh. I don't think we need to go out there. What is that? Is that like a, a seashell? Nothing? Darn. I gotta say, this island is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. I'm trying to just kind of like run around the edge of it so I know like the the size of it and kind of roughly where things... Oh, more berries. We need all of the berries. Some more lavender. Flowers of sort. You know what? Let's go into the dungeon. Let's see what we can find. Maybe, maybe we'll find some... Oh, what is this? I don't know what that is. That looks like something fancy, though. Okay, so there's the dungeon area. I'm wondering if, like... Let's just go into it. Let's see what happens. This is probably a horrible, terrible, awful disaster. We also don't have a torch. Oh, what is this? The ancient caves. Uh... Tool chest. Oh. Oh, nice. Okay, so we'll get some stuff here. What is this? It's like a workbench area. Oh, we got some like, we got some super money things. Oh, I bet you one of these is iron. I bet you this one is. This one looks special. Let's get it. Um, now. We can't see anything, so I am a little worried that we might get some enemies, but we're going to try this. We're going to see what happens here. Okay, so we've got... What did we get out of that? We got something. Food and farming resources. Coal. Oh, we got coal. Okay. And stone. Iron frag was found when mining iron nodes or refining stone. Oh, we can refine stone. Okay. I think we need that adventurer's torch. Um, oh yeah, we can't even really go any further. That's this is kind of like as far as we go right now. So what do we need to repair this? Use air rolls to jump over long distances. You can jump further when air rolling instead of a regular jump. Run and jump forward uh, after you've left the ground, then trigger a roll. Oh, what? Oh, that's super cool. Okay, so we can get across here. Uh oh, I'm scared because I still don't have a torch. It's probably a bad idea. Okay. This is a bad idea. Uh, can we light this? No, we don't have enough coal for that. I hear water. Uh, there's some rope. So it looks like we could light up some of this stuff. Oh, what is that? No, no, you know what? Let's try to fight it. Holy moly. That was a little scary. Uh, yeah, that was a little scary. Oh, there's another one. Oh, it's like a spider. Oh, I really wish I had a light. All right, let's mine this thing. Okay, so we actually got more coal. Uh, we have enough coal to light up one of these. Should we light up one? Light. It says five coal to light. Does that stay lit forever now? Oh, that'd be nice if it did. Oh, uh. Yeah, I don't know about this. I don't know about this at all. <laughs> I don't know about this. Oh, my food is like awful too. Oh, we get health as we eat too. Nice. Okay, we're getting out of here. Um, I think <laughs> maybe this is maybe we need to get some other stuff done first. All right, let's see what did we need. So we can't make anything unless we have iron pieces. Okay, well, what about that torch? Um, oh, we need <laughs> we need coal pieces, which we use to light that one fire. Uh, how many coal pieces do we actually have? We have one. We have one coal piece. Within caves, he's... Okay, fantastic. So, that's what we need for a torch. 
And we need iron pieces. Did we have enough to get the research for this guy? It uses steam to grind down large minerals into little bits so you can sift out. So I think this is what, if we refine stone, I think that might give us some stuff. But we need salvaged metal for that. And we only have seven. Dark essence, a dark evil substance found in the enemy is powerful and dangerous. Ooh. Okay. So I think we need to get the, um, I think we need to get that, that refining machine unlocked. Let's go around and let's see if we can't find any barrels or anything in the water. Oh, here's like a sandbar. Oh, look at that. Sandbar out to a different, oh, whoa. Uh, there's spiders here. Holy moly. Okay, we dealt with those. What were they guarding, though? There's not, there's nothing here. <laughs> All right, maybe we should, uh, maybe we should just go to sleep for the night. Oh, what a wonderful new day. Okay, let's go see if we can't find our stuff here. You know what? Let's go back into the cave. Let's see if the cave changes at all. Like, if anything, like, respawns or anything. Uh, let's see. We had to go this way. I'm also keeping an eye out for, like, barrels and stuff floating along the edge here because we did get some free... Oh, what is that? A water lily, maybe? It's a nice little, nice little pond area. All right, let's go into here. Let's see if anything respawned. Okay, so we've got uh, some stone in here that we could mine. Is our, I wonder if our light is still on. Let's just mine this to see if we get any um, coal from it. Probably should use a, a pickaxe instead. Oh, is there like a little gold thing there? Nope. Uh, I don't think we got any coal off of that. Nope. Okay. Uh, oh, this rock right here looks different. I think this one probably has coal in it. Oh, we got an iron flake. We got like one piece. Oh, we got a bunch of iron pieces. Oh, nice. I wonder if we should use those to make a sword or if we should make a watering can. <laughs> oh, the dilemma, the dilemma. Oh, we are full of stone already. Okay. So what can we do with stone? Oh, I wonder if we can upgrade our house from wood to stone. Hmm. And then how many iron pieces did we get? We got six. So that's, I think that's enough to make the watering can. Um, we need more gears and stuff. You know what? Let's just, let's, let's, let's go through here. Let's see what happens. Let's get our knife out. Let's see if uh, our light is still on down here. Oh, it is. So I wonder if those are perpetual. I hope they are. Oh. Oh, that takes 12. That looks like it's just a regular stone. Oh, 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 we need this. Uh, oh, we got five more parts. Yes. So it looks like the dungeon's like progressive. Oh, and then there's some more guys down there. Ugh. Yeah. Okay, well we got the um we got the thing we got the gears. So let's see if we can make the refinery and let's see if we can sift some stone in order to maybe get some more metal out of it. Cause it looks like I mean we're already oh what is this? Uh is that a coal node? That might actually be a coal node. But let's go try this first. Because that might give us a better source of metal, and if we are uh full on stone anyways. Okay, so let's go in here. Uh, this guy, this guy. Learn that. So now, okay, so that's, is that like research stuff? Refinery unlocked. So now, um, oh my gosh, we need 35 of those gears. Oh, that's not going to happen anytime soon. Uh, okay, so maybe, maybe we should go with one of our tools here. Oh, we need 12. I mean, we could get the watering can. I feel like a sword would be nice. You know what? Let's get the watering can. That's going to give us survivability. You know, um, yeah, let's go ahead and craft that. Basic watering can unlocked. 
Do I have it? Grab to equip and put that right there. So just a little blueberry seedling. No, I want a water. Oh, Q is water. There we go. Put water in one end and tip out the other. So can I just go to the ocean and get water? I mean, it's salt water, so I don't know. Okay, that that it made a different sound when I went in the water that time. So it makes me think that maybe that filled up. We could plant lavender. I'm curious if we have any other berries and stuff. Maybe we should try to go to the town. The town might give us some more things. And it doesn't look like it was that super crazy to get to either. Because it looked like it was like, what, wood and the limestone? Yeah, all we need is 40 limestone. Let's make that happen. That's like super easy. Because each one of those little limestone nodes gives us quite a bit. So, I mean, like there's 33 right there from one node. I think if we hit one more, we'll be good. Oh, some glass. Very nice. Okay, so there's another 24. How much do we have? 76. We need 80. Whoa, there's a house here. Once the perfect residence for an uh, experienced fisher hasn't been living in for many years with some love and care, this shack could be a home of a fishing friend one day. So I wonder if we repair that if somebody will move in. I don't even know. I'm so, this is so cool. Oh, there's another barrel. Uh, four more parts. More glass, more glass, more limestone. Yes. All right, we have enough. Let's do this. Let's go visit the town. All right, let's do it. Repair. Oh, buddy. To the town we go. Oh, look at there's other people. Oh, it's Bridgewater. Hello. Good afternoon, friend. How can I help you? I'm just passing through. Thanks. What is this place? This is Bridgewater Traveler. My name is Gerald. I am the mayor of this corner of the world. Uh, if you're settling on the island, be aware of the darkness that lurks beneath. Many travelers have come to the island in search of its power. Few ever return. This town is built by travelers such as yourself seeking new beginnings. And the island is a paradise for those who dare to live on it. Just be careful, my friend. Oh, look at that. Forgotten Island. Oh, we live on the Forgotten Island. That's my island. Um, can I just go in this person's house? Wait, could I have, like, lived there? Wait, could I have lived in this whole area? Uh, let's talk to this guy. Greetings, friend. It's Martinelle. Hello there. That's it? What's this? Uh, buy for five, sell for one. Oh, we can sell logs to him. Okay. Can we buy those gears? Uh, looks like we got some archery stuff. Uh, I don't know if I should break that. What is this? That's our stuff. Oh, there was an archery thing. Okay. Let's see. Oh, this whole town is super cool. There's not a lot of people here. I wonder if I fix things up. If like the town starts growing, there's a florist. Hello. Hey, uh. Um. Oh, maybe this is why we would want to grow our own stuff. So five lavender is five gold. Backpacks, clothes, and magic. Uh, backpacks. Increases inventory slots to 250. Increases hotbar slots to five. So there's a little bit of money making to be had here. Howdy there. Sure is a af nice afternoon. It is. Blacksmith. Oh. Refined mace. It costs all of these things. Oh, that's cool. What is this? Iron shards. Buy for 20, sell for three. Oh. There's coal. <gasps> yes. Salvage metal. Buy for 30. Ugh. We need to make money. What we got up here? Who are you? Knight Guinevere? Hello. I don't really want to just go in random people's houses. I feel like that's just not a good way to start anything. Uh, farmer's Market. Blueberries. Five. See, five blueberries sell for three gold. That's not bad. I think we need to farm stuff in order to make money and then we can buy like a whole bunch of goodies. 
There's a whole bunch of pumpkins and stuff. Oh, this is super cool. Oh, there's money to be made. What are you? You look super magical. What is this stuff? A thorn. Once owned by an infamous giant to pick up the remains of the enemies. Pick the enemies from their teeth. Oh, goodness. That's quite silly. <laughs> Circle of life. Upon its owner's demise, the shield will drop a single seed that will sprout another shield in its place. Oh, that's kind of cool. Druid Floyd Ray, Ray, Radier. Hello. Just browsing your good. Thanks. Bye. I have got to say, I was not expecting all of this uh, extra town stuff. Like money making and buying stuff and like getting better. Go oh my gosh. I'm ready. I am ready to do it. Uh, oh, for sale. 500 gold to buy that plot of land right there, huh? Ugh. Well, pricey if you ask me. Um, oh, what are those? What were those? Are those like gems or something? Sapphire. Precious gems found while we're finding clay. Oh, nice. Okay, we need to get back. It's uh, night. Oh, actually, I need some berries. I'm like going to fall apart here. Okay. Um, bring that in there and then eat. And then tools and stuff. So where do my tools just go? I don't have it with me now. So it looks like I have to use those storage boxes. Okay. All right, let's head back. So what it sounds like to me is that we need to do a little bit of everything. We need to do a little bit of survival, but we also need to do, um, actually, lavender, plant all. We actually need to do a little bit of money making too, which is super cool. And then are these berries ready for pickings? Small berries are starting to grow. However, they're much too small and sour to eat just yet. Okay. So we need to get like a super huge farm going so that way we can uh, get everything. Going. Oh, you know what? There was also a well. I wonder if that's where I was supposed to get the water from for the. Uh... I bet you it is. I bet you it is. Oh, my gosh. We got to start planting everything. We've got so many things to do. Oh, geez. I got attacked by beast. Holy moly. There was uh there was a beehive in that tree. Jeez Louise. That was gonna take me down. So what did we need in order to build? We need to get the well. And then wood frame farm. Like that's all we need. We could just build a whole bunch of these things. Uh what am I out of here? I'm out of reeds. Okay, let's grab some reeds. Oh, look at our huge crop plot now. Oh yes. So now we can get to plant a whole bunch of things in here. So that is how we're going to make the money. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, so lavender. Now I'm wondering, I'm guessing each thing is probably going to net us. Like if we plant one, we're probably going to get more back. So if we plant one berry. We'll probably get maybe two berries back. If we plant. I mean, that would make sense, right? I don't know. Um, we need our watering can, though. All right, let's see. Um, let's go ahead and get this guy out and let's water all of this. I think we also need to get the... So it looks like that's empty. Watering can is empty. Let's go ahead and build our... How, why is my health still going down? I wonder if it's because of my hunger. Hmm. We need more reeds and we got to get our... Uh, we got to get a proper well in here. I wonder if my health is going down because I'm hungry. It's the only thing I can think of. All right, now let's get our well in here. Um, well, well, well. <laughs> All right. So is our watering can full now? It appears as though it is. So now we need to get as much stuff growing in here as possible so we can make the monies. Okay, so I grabbed a bunch of plants. Uh, marigold, plant all. Because why not? Uh, plant all lavender. And then berries. Mm, I kind of need that as a food source. But I'm hoping that once we grow these, we can get a whole bunch more plants. Because, hey, flowers are worth money. I'm just saying. Now, they do kind of take a while to grow, so... Um, hopefully we'll have a payday here soon, but yeah, that's going to end this 
first look at Lens Island. I gotta say, I'm surprised. I like the base building. It's pretty neat. I like the uh, the progression. The dungeons are pretty cool. I like the town. Like making money is always fun to do. And yeah, I just I'm liking this. I'm liking this. So uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below. I will have a link down below as well for uh, Lens Island if you want to check it out. But yeah, that's going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. And uh, you have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day. See you in the next one. Bye, everybody.